Hi everyone, welcome back to a new video. In this video, we're going to discuss how you can complete the mixed settings fun run. It's quite an easy to medium difficulty death run. It's not hard, everyone should be able to complete it. It's a death run quite interesting and fun with a few levels that you have to complete to get to the end of the map. So uh, without further ado, let's start. So basically to complete this map and unlock the vault, you need to complete every single level. You need to get through every single one and unlock the last one, the green one right there. And then the vault is gonna open and you completed the map. So the first one is a normal one. So this level is all about the impulse grenades. The first two jumps are quite easy. The next one is easy, don't use an impulse grenade. Again. And again, don't use an impulse grenade. Now here you need to use it. And here as well. Now here you need to use a double impulse. And you need to be really fast in order to do it, but it's not impossible. So that was the first level, the normal one. The second one is timing. Now for this level basically you need to use the shotgun and shoot at the circles, like that one, the other one, the other one, the other one, and that one. And that's it. That was the first part. Now, after you use the impulse grenade, you need to shoot the circle to get the floor up. Just like that. And repeat. And I think this one is the last one. Yeah. It's not impossible, it's quite easy I would say. Now this one, you need to shoot all the balls in less than 4 seconds. That's basically it, that's the timing one. The next one is high gravity. Oh, by the way, take, uh, if you need, use some checkpoints, take them with you, like take two or three of them, you might need them. Now for this part, you need to make the jump after the wall, just like this, keep doing it, and one more, and that's it, now jump. Be careful, the first one doesn't work, but the second one does. So that was the high gravity level. Now the next one. So for this one, uh, you need to be fast. That's all I can tell you. Be fast. And just keep going. Ignore the traps and everything. Take the right side. Right here. Keep going further. And you need to impulse right here. That's basically it. It's one easy level. You just need to run and ignore the traps. The next one, the editing. If you want to, take a, take a checkpoint. Here, just make a door. And then jump on the door. And jump on the next level. For this level, you need to make a T. That's what it says. Edit a T shape. And then once again, jump on the door. And jump higher. Again, do the same thing. Do a T. And that's it. Now here, use the checkpoint. And uh, we need to edit really fast. And that's basically it, you made it. So that was the editing level. Now for this level, this one is a bit harder. You need to take three checkpoints. Make sure to take three of them. And just be really fast. Ignore the damage. Okay, now you need to time it really good. This part. Run, 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 run. Use a checkpoint here. Since you have full life, you can definitely make it all the way up there and get the checkpoint to get to the next level. But you need to be really fast. So that was the hardest level. If you made it, the map is almost done. Okay, now for the next level, the speed one. 
You're gonna get a boost speed and just keep running. It's that easy. Just keep running and it's easy, it's not a hard level. The next one, backwards. This one is a bit more complicated because you need to make the jumps with your back. So, just like this. You need to run backwards and do the jumps. It's a bit hard, maybe. But uh, it's not an impossible level. Now for this part, just hold backwards and that's basically it. Maybe the first two parts are, are hard for this level. The first one where you have to jump and the second one with the, with the impulse, but it's not an impossible level. You can do it. You can definitely do it. And now the almost the last one, <laughs> the low gravity one. Take a checkpoint if you want to. Jump on the first cloud. Jump on the second one. Now for this one you need to jump after the wall. Use the checkpoint right here. Shoot this wall. Now for the next part just use crouch. And try to avoid all the pillars. It's not hard, but it might take you a few tries. Now the last level is unlocked. For this one, this one is the easiest one. You just need to hold forward. Now for this level, as previously mentioned, you just need to hold forward. Don't use left or right. Keep holding forward and you will make it to the end. If you think that you need to adjust it, then do it. If you need to adjust it to be on the middle of everything. But in theory, it should be fine if you keep holding forward only. So that was basically it. That was the last level. Grats for making it all the way here. Thank you for watching the video. Let me know in the comments if you enjoyed the map. My name is Ranko and I'm out.